For using MBP007 high sickle kit, first take out all the ingredients from the box. To make the reagent, add DS0098 that is potassium phosphate dibasic and DS0099 potassium phosphate monobasic to the bottle of water which is labeled as ML024. Shake the bottle so that the solution becomes clear. It can take few minutes. After that, in the solution, add DS-0100 that is saponin and DS0101 sodium dithionate. Please note that after adding saponin, we can't shake the bottle vigorously. Otherwise, lot of froth will be developed. Our reagent mix is ready. To start the solubility experiment, place the test tubes in the test tube stand. By the help of the dropper, take the reagent mix and add to the tube till the mark which is approximately 2 ml. You can see the black lines as all the tubes contain the transparent solution. For starting the experiment, take out the tape and fix it in the pipette. Which is a fixed volume pipette of 25 microliter. For blood Pricking, put a lancet, take out the blood and add the blood sample by the use of the pipette tape to the test tube. Gently mix the tubes for 10 to 15 seconds. Allow the tubes to stand for 10 to 15 minutes at room temperature. After that, read the result. For interpretation of result, we have to see whether we can observe the black lines or not. In the first two tubes, you can see the solutions are not turbid and we can see the black lines 
which is behind the tube but in the third and fourth tube the solution is turbid and we can't see the black lines behind the tube that means the first two tubes contain the blood of a normal person and the third and fourth are having the blood of a sickle disease person